So, hello and welcome back to another episode of Super 4. We're of course playing with the Winds of Change DLC, that's Germany. And we are uh, currently fighting Great Britain in the last war that we'll ever have. They have Kilwa on their side, which is of course unpleasant. But what can you do? There is some more British territory. There's Australia and uh, Newfoundland as well, right? And British Louisiana. Which is tiny. <laughs> but technically all part of the uh, uh, British stuff. So it's gonna be a bit of work to get it done. We do have uh, some hurt navies. Because surprisingly enough the British navy is for some reason actually tough. It's weird how this works, right? But, what we really need to do, I think, at this point is probably wait for some of these guys to finish up that I've now just given something to. I mean, the boats shouldn't take long. We have, like, we have, like, shipbuilding stuff everywhere to reduce that timer. Let's hope. Currently all know, wait, do we have one navy over here? Do we just, uh, this question if we just waltz over and deal with it? Aha! And this is, this is a bit, this is a bit like... I mean, obviously they have some territory around. Yeah, they're, they're, but this is not gonna be the, uh, worth it. I feel like also these places... Like, there's no development here, right? Nothing whatsoever. It's really just, uh, I think... I mean, not even Australia seems to be that big. Mapuche is under Kilwa, I assume, yeah. What about all of these guys? Yeah, they're, they're, they're all of these are vessels of uh, Kilwa. So, we can finally actually def up something that might be efficient. Isn't that crazy? Instead of pu pushing everything into the Rhineland. So, let's do that a little bit. There we go. I mean, I guess corruption or inflation would have not mattered either way. Where are you guys retreating to? Okay, you guys are finished. We are still waiting for that boat. We are getting ticking war score. The thing is, as always, I, I don't want to just send out uh, small groups. Because they're just gonna get slapped around by Kilwa. I mean, Kilwa does have a few unpleasant alliances, right? Aren't they also allied to the Ottoman? No, they're now only allied to Great Britain. I see. I see. I'll just quickly spend some points. And we could have also thought about culture conversion and stuff like that. But I, th I think it's gonna be rather expensive. Of course, the Polish are the easiest to culture convert. <laughs> cool. I see. Give us it. Uh, do we have another one? We don't. All right. Then you'll do. You. This is, this is a lot more to organize. <laughs> Okay, you are finished. How long are these guys gonna take? I do see a w one more full ship here. Uh, then, I'll, then I'll just... Uh, hold on a second. You're missing a heavy. Which is this one. Why are you missing boats? <sighs> Why are these guys never fully building up? Oh, that's pleasant. All right, let's uh, let's send someone over. What do we just do the waiting? It's gonna take forever if we do it that way. Let's actually go overseas for for a change. Let's start down here. 
Or do we just do exactly... No, we could just immediately land on Gilva. Screw it. You're not going for French Congo, are you? Ah, <sighs> alright. You're gonna go next to Kilwa as well. Then one more army. Goes here as well. And then one more. That should be... Three armies should be enough. Kilwa probably has more numbers, I assume. But I don't think they will engage in an attack like that. go keep that up a little bit uh, we could also probably do some stuff here all right look at these guys dying and getting deleted of course they're sending in one uh, sending over a navy that is not that uh, well structured come home this one goes back here where you're waiting for your boats let's quickly see about this little adventure here I see you all moving about Kill some stuff on the way, sure. Do I just... Nah, I see no reason to take this ahead of time. We're actually free here again. So, no needs. Oh, okay, there's nothing here. Uh, do we just quickly... Yeah, let's, let me just quickly deal with this. You're not just standing with your boats here. I'm not gonna plop it in unconditional surrender, probably. I also don't think that they're gonna attack this uh, army down there. Just let them siege down the capital. Even if it takes a while. <laughs> <laughs> we can't just keep doing that. <laughs> and we're at 42%. Is there any chance of these guys just unconditionally surrendering? Probably not. This one was, uh, yeah, too expensive. Okay, are we getting a bunch of points? So, and you guys also no expectations and we can def admin du, 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 du. then once more should push this down well enough So, Kilwa is on medium. 12. That is not enough. Let's just quickly convince them, otherwise. British particularists. Uh huh. There we go. Kilwa, stop being silly. You should understand that this doesn't go anywhere. Let's go for the next fort. Hey. Are they gonna go towards uh, Kilwell proper? They are. Cool. Is this army enough to deal with this? I mean, Kilwa is coastline, so we're not gonna get much stuff here. Yeah, but. <laughs> <laughs> ah, I love it. Murder, murder, murder. Yeah, they're, they're not liking that. <laughs> I would like you to be stopping allies to Great Britain. There we go. 
at 79%. How much more can we take up? We can gain 6.6. .6. Alright, first of all, you guys are just gonna run home. There's like literally nothing else that you can do. Uh, all of you are finished. It's a question now. Are you? I mean, you have a fort. <laughs> How much army do you have? You do have a decent chunk of army. What about Australia? Australia feels too feels too far too far away. Yeah, let's let's do it this way. Uh, you guys could technically all come over here at some point. There's not much for you to stick around there. Come on, everyone, spread out. You've done enough for sightseeing in Hungary. You can all come home. Well done. Uh, one of these armies is once again missing some stuff, as always. Seems to be a common theme now. Of course, they, then they uh, start popping around. So, we have 80%. Let's send you over here. Send you over here. We're just gonna quickly get this island fully. Maybe that's gonna be then the uh, the, the little bit of war that I need to actually finish this up. And you come here. All right. one of those navies is uh, the thingy. Back to this. And this is of course now a rather laggy process. I'm surprised how how uh, uh, eager they are to for me to death uh, cows. So and so. All right. That of course also finishes this up and okay we had I guess a healthy amount of development at this point. Alright, just just blob down there guys. It doesn't matter if you're nearly hurt. Wow that that was a rather fast process. 84 you guys pop in here. Kill them all, kill them all. So, this is a very laggy experience. Oh, you got two light chips. Now you're giving up. Alright, we'll just recover some numbers here. And then we're gonna start spreading out. Let me just quickly check something. You guys... I mean, obviously we can take the rest of the Isles. But I would take a, a bit more than that. It wasn't there also. Oh yeah. This is 55. Let's check on... Uh yeah, this is gonna be all of this uh, stuff here. Yep, yeah, this one has a fort. So I just want to quickly check if it would be possible to uh, occupy everything, if we have the Warsco for that, because uh, that would give us all of these colonies. At least that somewhat give me the feeling of uh, uh, having accomplished that. Okay, you actually have just some stuff as well here. I think we actually can do that, yeah? This would be full annexation of the, of the British. We would need to... Uh, Find some more forts to siege, though. I mean, you guys recover from that little uh, experience. Unless they uh, unconditionally surrender. There's a fort here. I mean, this is a fort, but we don't want that. Huh? One of those immediately told me that uh, we need a fort. To occupy. But I don't see a fort here. Oh no, there's a fort. Aha. Uh -huh. 
occupied by rebels or getting sieged by rebels. We should have an, one more navy here, yeah. Well, let's see. I take that. I mean, I see two forts here. Oh wait, this is not even their fort. This one is a fort. All right. Let's quickly go over. We'll see how well this goes. We can quickly uh, see about you guys and gathering some more uh, uh, war score. So let's quickly spread out. If you wanna fight, you can fight. Otherwise, I murder. It's a bit more every time. It's a bit more. <coughs> so, just waiting for that. I assume that you don't have a fort here, right? No. Is this boat gone? No, these guys are not gonna die. You are taking a rather risky road. Especially when there is a... Uh, God dang it. Not really, right? Of course I had to find these guys here. Obviously. This is gonna kill a bunch of my boats. Let's see if my heavies at least uh, survive. Uh, my transport ships at least survive. You guys make landfall here so we can't sit. Da, 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 da. Attack, of course. Whatever. Uh, there is a call for peace. I mean, these guys are not accepting yet, so... I'll sit on that burning flame as long as possible. Uh, can we escape? No. This navy might get beaten up then. Which is unpleasant, but hey. You guys, supply. We can get in with another navy soon enough. We do have more of those, after all. You come over here, because we d do need to siege this one as well. And you guys just, uh, I mean, I guess we can make landfall here. Oh, we did also have another rebellion, there we go. You guys are currently not helping, are you? There we go. And I guess we are gonna quickly start that while you guys recover. Oh god, I need to wait until we <laughs> get some more numbers in. There we go. That should be a shit ton of admin as well. Let me just quickly do this stuff. There we go. What should we need? 31. Okay, one more tick and we can do that. We do have another. So, quickly recover. And then you come here. And then we'll see. This is still a fort, yeah. We have two forts here. That need to be taken care of. This one and this one. I hope there's no, no, none other. Okay, you guys are still repairing. Are we winning that fight? Hopefully. You guys are annoying me now. I mean, they repaired a little bit. I can put in these guys as reinforcements. Yeah, and that tells them uh, no. I assume that this is also needed. Yep. Let's see how well this goes. Do you have some revolutionaries there? Have they achieved anything yet? That would make my life easier. In terms of sieging? Nope, they haven't. I see. You guys just take attrition. Could you guys stop constantly having random rebellions? That really uh, st stops the flow here. Oh, there's another group. Oh, look at that. The Ottoman. They do have a million, but they're seemingly getting beaten down now. Which is an, uh, the l a lovely sight. 
so. That nah, just takes a hot second. Oh, goddammit. There we go. Quickly, hastily do that. Power of the fleet. There we go. Siege over. That should be enough. Yes, there we go. Bye bye, Britain. Cost me 22 aggressive expansion to do that. With that, I should have a bunch of new friends, right? Yay. Oh, we can find Indian Trade Company. Lovely. If all of these cool friends over here. Look at them. They're a bit upset about this whole situation. They're probably not too used to that kind of stuff. And we also don't really have any kind of decent reduction going on. But we have achieved what we wanted to achieve. All of that funny British stuff is in my hands. What about you? And all of a sudden this looks a lot more German, right? <laughs> yeah. Hey, separatists! Oh no, wait, I'm not gonna bother with this nonsense. Alright. We've achieved what we want to achieve. <coughs> we have basically done all of the Euro European conquests. I feel like we could probably get this done as well, but I, I'm not gonna bother with Afri Africa now. These guys also all change color. Yeah. Let's have a quick look. <coughs> I mean, we have been blessed with fairly decent rulers, but that's also something that just happens with the brush and stuff. We are not gonna go through all of these modifiers, but we've basically spent most of the time with full Prussian militarization. Prussian monarchy, the Kaiserreich, sadly enough not the army of the state. Otherwise, I shall the General War Com Commissariat. Lovely. Financially, we don't even need to look at that. We are getting a lot of money, mainly through production. Idea groups. I mean, I don't know about efficiency, but this is just funny. <laughs> it just works. Military is uh, bombastic, and we are alright with that. We can we now have the option to restore the Roman Empire. We're not doing that. <coughs> we have been working quite well on that religious map mode. Getting all the rest of the stuff Protestant. Actually, we could quickly jump over to this culture map mode, but I don't think there's anything crazy going on. I have not been doing any kind of crazy culture conversions. Military-wise, we have we are insane. Those infantry combat ability and that discipline working quite well. I could have done more drilling, but... Either way, this will be it for this playthrough, and I guess I'll see you guys on the next playthrough. Bye!